drop. So I'm still gonna try to make this look a little sexy because we're gonna try to make this funny. You can up and around and down. Up and around and down. When you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answer to no man, I still go. Go, 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 go. Alright, so I decided to do a confidence booster workout, part one and part two. Part one is going to be the boring part. Part one is going to be just strictly focusing on toning our muscles and getting rid of some of the fat and toning up. So, I don't know, so you can get a decent looking butt and everything else, okay? And so that way you feel better about yourself in your own skin. Part two is going to be where the guys will probably enjoy watching you because that's when we're going to do some fun, sexy moves that is actual workout moves, but that to some guys, probably they watch a workout through and they see that move come into the workout and they probably think it looks a little sexy. So we're going to do that on part two. So if you like this workout, don't forget to hit subscribe, like and share and comment. If you're a first time viewer, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll tell you about my social media at the end. Let's have some fun. So we're going to warm it up and stretch it out. One and two, stretching and hold. Other side, again, stretching out one and two and hold. Moving it down. Holding it out, out, out. side out and bring it up turn it front ways stretching that leg out and sideways and stretching that leg out All right, what's the first thing that us women complain about that we can, don't like hearing? Some of us think we either have too much or we have too little. So what we're gonna do is with one weight, taking it up and bringing it down. All right, here we are strengthening our chest muscles. Now for guys, we get some big pecs. For us girls, we get stronger chest muscles. And eventually it's going to push our breast tissue out and make us look bigger. Weight down and out and pop that chest. Two, three, bringing that weight up right here. We're going to use this part to and squeeze and release and squeeze release all right here's a fun little move to do with your weight take it up and around and down up and around and down. Working out our shoulders. We want those cuts in your shoulders to where it's nice and firm. This is going to get it. Bring it down. I want you to go straight to the side. Right here, we're gonna start working on 
strengthening our butt muscles. So one, two, three, and four. Feeling those in your calves too. See how strong those muscles are. Remember, this is a confidence booster workout. So I'm still gonna try to make this look a little sexy because we're gonna try to make this funny. <laughs> because girls, most of you are uncomfortable with doing those kind of moves. And what does it do? It makes you laugh. So now what we're gonna do is we're going to go into what is called a deadlift. Deadlift is going to work and strengthen and give you a nice butt lift. So it's going to strengthen the lower part of your butt and it's gonna make it up and kind of force your butt, which forces your butt to have that look of a butt lift look without hand going and giving the surgery for a butt lift, right? So taking it up right here, straighten it out, 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 back nice and straight. Stomach is in. And then bring it up at the top. You're gonna to squeeze that butt in nice and tight and then release it as you take it down again. Down, back nice and straight, bring it up, 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 up. Squeeze that butt and muscles and relax them. If you don't believe me that I'm squeezing my butt muscles, see if you can see it from back here. Taking it down, bring it up. Squeeze as you come to the top and release as you go down and squeeze. Okay. Bringing that weight down to the floor and we'll point that toe in one, two, Come on, you're gonna feel it right here in your butt. And switching sides. Up, one, two. down right here let's start firming up those thighs Take it down and bounce two hold on that weight in your hand taking it down and roll and roll those ankles Strengthening our thigh muscles, as well as our ankles and our calves. Bring it down here. Now, weight to the ground. I want you to take it and squeeze that butt and squeeze. You're gonna feel yourself shifting forward slightly through here, and that's normal. You're also gonna work out your ab muscles, doing it just right, and taking it in and out, in, out, two, Come on, try to pretend there's something in between your legs and you're squishing it together. Bring it up, 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 because now you should be on fire. Taking it down. Right here. Ready? Pulse it. Tiny pulses. A 
other side. Right here. Pulse it. And up. Bringing it down. Give me a nice hold. And up. In two, three, and four. And sliding it side to side. Down into that squat, squeeze, up, down, squeeze, and up. Bringing it down for me. There we go. That's where I want them to be. Nice it up. We don't like that. Okay. Now, taking your stomach in, out, in, out. Contracting that stomach. You can do this sitting in a chair, sitting on your couch. Taking it down. One, two. Can you add your arm? Staying down in that squat low. And taking it to the floor. Right here. Now, I want you to go down into Superman pose. Superman pose, uh, one of the first twice, is great for getting the dimples in your back. You probably can't see them too well in this video, but I definitely have, you know, everybody has back dimples right here. A lot of times guys think it's sexy, don't ask me why. But anyway, you want to start feeling better about yourself? We're going to work on those, okay? So, sliding it down. And Superman is a great way to get. So you're going out in Superman pose, meaning forward toes are pointed. Arms are straight and pointed forward. And lifting up off the ground and holding. And bring it down. Up and hold. And down. Up and hold. And down. And taking it up. I want you to take your arms. Holding it up, 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 off the ground. Back. And in. Two. In our shoulders. Our upper arms, getting those toned sexy cuts that ladies like. They want to see in their backs. And hold. Hold, 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 hold. And release. And up. And two. And three. 
bring those legs up. Squeeze that butt. Squeeze and squeeze. Squeeze. And bringing it together and up and out. Up and out. All right, who doesn't want a firmer stump? Superman does it, crunches does it. Let's do some fun crunches. Okay. Taking it, rolling it back on that one leg here. Hand out and one and reach. Doing it this way kind of forces you to keep your abs nice, hold in tight. Okay. Switching legs. Now this is toning workout. Part two is gonna be the fun workout. We're still gonna tone up though. So no mistake. One, two, three. Keeping those abs tight. Once you take it slowly, rolling it over onto your stomach, going up into plank pose right here. And one. Bring it down, out, roll it up, and out. Down, out, roll it up, and out down, up, and out. We're almost done. Bringing it down for me, right here, and up, into some again. Make it harder. Put that leg off the ground. Out, same thing. Leg either down or up. Put in and right here. forward, taking it around, and we're all done for today. So take it up, 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 stretching it above your head, leaning it forward, and hold. Stretching out those hips. Inside and bringing it down. Hands behind your back, lean it forward. Hand her over your 
shoulder looking the opposite direction. Opposite direction. Stretching it back to a cactus and hold. Down, rolling that neck side to side. All finished. Whatever you do, keep moving, keep eating healthy, don't ever give up. Do this kind of workout all the regularly, other thigh, but leg workouts. Ab workouts, get yourself nice tone. Trust me, work on squeezing those butt muscles during those squats, squeezing those butt muscles during those deadlifts. My whole point was to teach you how to do that during this workout. And because that is what helps. When people make this mistake of when they're doing squats, when they're doing lunges, when they're doing deadlifts, is they do them but they don't pull the butt muscles in and squeeze them in nice and tight. If you want the results, you have to work your butt muscles. Have to. You know, you see these women with the bubble butts. They don't do it by just squatting and up and down and up and down and up and down and not putting any contractions on those butt muscles. You have to contract them. That's why you squeeze them coming up from the deadlift. You squeeze them going into that squat and holding. You squeeze them when you're in that sumo squat when you're down low and coming up out and releasing. If you don't do that nice little squeeze, you're not going to get the results as fast. You'll get it, but it'll take a lot longer. And when in a shorter period, amount of time period, you need to learn to squeeze those butt muscles. It's the whole point of this workout. That's why we did a lot of training you on squeezing your butt muscles. And this is just part one. Part two is just going to be more like dancing and flowing through the music kind of thing um, and having a little bit of fun. But don't make no mistake. I'm going to work you. We're going to do some toning moves too like we just did. So I'm going to part two. So get ready for me.